Uh, hey, everybody. Uh, great to chat with all three of you. Thanks, Tom. How you doing, man? It's Tom. Uh, oh, I'm doing great. Uh, I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm a big fan uh, of all of you guys. And this movie, uh, I, obviously, it gets dark towards the end. But what I just loved about it was the, the camaraderie of the three of you guys on camera. And, and, and the fact that I feel like, to some extent, a lot of people you kind of know each one of these characters, you know, in your, in your own life. Like I know a Packy and, and I know a guy who's a Sueno. Um, so that was really interesting to me. Uh, the first question for you, uh, John Polono, um, talk about just adapting this from your original work and, and some of those challenges. Uh, was there anything that you were afraid of that maybe wouldn't transfer well to the screen from the stage? Uh, I, you know, I definitely, was very you know sentimental about the play so you know when i adapt when you adapt something into a movie you have to be pretty objective about it so that was not easy to sort of start that process of, of of you know cutting away anything that didn't work and then eventually the the screenplay and the movie took on a life of its own and it was just a joy to try it a different way i, I really looked at it as in a way to put this story and the characters to rest in their sort of final form. And once that kind of happened, I, I, I really, you know, enjoyed the process, but, you know, opening it up and making it uh, feel like a movie and not a play, you know, obviously being really hyper conscious of that. Um, I feel like the themes in 2011 are more relevant now than ever but there's always the challenge of creating such an unfiltered provocative piece of art in, in a time where people aren't maybe doing that or, or don't aren't embracing that, but we either had to go out on a limb and say, you know, put heart in it and make something really real, raw and truthful, and then kind of let people, uh, you know, figure it out on their own. Gentlemen, how are you? Good. How you doing, man? Okay. Good. Shay, this is becoming a weekly thing for us now. I think it's nice, kind of Greg. Nice to see you, man. I love yeah, but you do. He's a big film. He's a cinephile. He loves cinema, guys. Oh, Absolutely. Great. Like I said, love all types of movies. And like with this one, uh, just starting out with John P. You guys were buddies growing up. And the thing that really, you know, got to me about this story is there are guys who they're not your blood brothers, but you have all been through so much stuff. And for no matter what, you've got your arguments and everything, but you are going to remain brothers, right? Yes. Yeah, I, look, I think... <clears throat> I kind of look at them as one character and they're three mm -hmm. facets of one character and, you know, bonded by trauma and a shared history and all that. And they don't really exist without each other. And that's sort of the beauty of it. And then what we're saying and when they separate and they that's when the trouble really happens. And it's all about, you know, unifying. Ultimately, to me, the theme of the piece is love and connection and, and, and finding that. Nope, absolutely. Because, yeah, Shay, I mean, you guys are beating each other up, you know, a lot, and they're teasing you, you're teasing each other. But again, just when it comes down to it, it's like, hey, we can talk to each other that way, but you can't. Mm -hmm. Well, I think you just said it. I think that's, that's, it's that, uh, you know, whether you read about twins that, you know, can fight, 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 but anybody else comes in there and talk and says something bad about them. I think that was what we really, correct me if I'm wrong, Polana, but we really concentrated on that. We talked it. We talked yeah. it for, for like ten days together and let this thing organically build. Because you you have to do. It. I mean, look, Greg. It's no secret. I came into this. This thing had been performed uh, countless times, hundreds of times on both coasts, and I I choose stuff now, either to work with people I love, yeah. or to be really scared and challenged. And this did, this did both. And, it, and one grew out of the other. I was scared to come in because four or five people had played Packy. These guys had done it and they welcomed me in there. But there's still a pressure. There's an enormous amount of pressure on you to, 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 to come in and, you know, and they, they did. They, they welcomed me in. And, you know, I, I, it's a beautiful piece, man. I'm, 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 I'm I'm really proud of this piece because it's tricky. It's tough. These things, as I told you last week, they're never easy. There's never enough money. There's never enough days. There's never enough locate your locations fall through and to be able to put it together and then tell a story and tell something that where people are really going to be, they're going to love it. They're going to not to be cliche, but if a cliche sticks, it's true. They're going to laugh. They're going to cry. They're going to be angry. They're going to be you know, everything. And I, I think we did that. It's, it's a piece of art, I think. Uh, t for John uh, Bernthal, um, with your character, having having played it uh, on stage, um, 
you know, I know actors approach, you know, the, the, you know, for the medium, maybe a little bit differently, but talk about, uh, you know, what were you trying to bring to the, 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 the screen performance of your character versus uh, on stage? You know, it's, it's, look, it's, it, the whole thing's different. I mean, the, 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 the things that are similar is, is, look, this is about the family you choose. It's about your lifelong best friends. Like you said, you know, guys like this, we yeah. all have people in our lives like this. And, and you, you're taking these, these, these unbelievably layered and, 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 and rich lifelong friendships where we know each other's strengths, our weaknesses, our insecurities. We know all that stuff. The bond is so there. And then you put them in unbelievably dangerous and impossible situations. Uh, look, things change. You know, I'm 10 years older, you know, than when mm -hmm. I did it on stage. Now we got Shay. Shay playing Packy has a whole different deal. <laughs> yeah. whole different energy and you got you to gotta treat it as such. And I think we all were just so thrilled to kind of have this beautiful piece of material and have these other you know, you know, artists to make it with that we all believed in. And there's no, no telling which way this went. You know, look, I, I, I say to people, I think what's so great about this piece is you don't know what kind of genre this is. It's a buddy thing. And then it's a, a thriller yeah. and then it's it, but the thing you, you believe it the whole way through and you're with these guys, but there's unbelievable twists and turns and it's unbelievably dangerous. And, and I think very provocative and, and, and it really challenges the audience. And I think like, what John said, I think, I think, I think folks are hungry for that now. Yeah. There's nothing spoon fed or easy or politically correct about this uh, movie. And I think, uh, I think people are going to jump on that. Like that, John B. I mean, like we said, everybody's got their own different personalities and truthfully watching you guys perform, it was like you've all known each other for 20, 30 years yourselves, you know, just by the way they were getting along. Talk a little bit about that interaction. I mean, just like I said, you guys were, were like 30 year old friends. <laughs> Yeah, look, I, I think so much of that really starts with the with the word, you know, I mean, look, John and I have been friends now for for a long time. You know, we, we, we met over 10 years ago on this play. We performed this play together. We become uh, our, our families are very intertwined. Uh, we've become uh, very much creative partners. We run things by each other all the time. But and also just, you know, look, I, I, I think that, um, you know, lifelong friendships are uh you, you know, it's, 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 it's the family you choose. And, and, and I think that that's really, this is a celebration of that in, in all its ugliness, in all its beauty. It, 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 it's the people that you depend on when you're at your lowest. And, uh, you know, I, I really think that this movie, it digs into the wound of that, you know, it doesn't, it doesn't, it's, it's not, it's just as funny as sort of like a beautiful comedy, uh, a buddy comedy, but then it goes into such sort of dark spaces. And, 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 and I think you would say from seeing it, it really will challenge you. No matter who you are, this movie will challenge you. It will press you and put you into some uncomfortable situations as it does with these people. And I think the reason why it's so uncomfortable is because you believe that these guys all love each other so much. You know people like that. Everybody has people like this in their life, the people they depend on when, when the chips are down. So, um, you know, like Shay said, I'm, I'm enormously proud of it. I'm enormously proud of John, what he, what he took on here, when you really think of everything that he did. And uh, I think people are going to love this film. Got to go give it a shot. Oh, absolutely. Like you said, it, it is. It's just so intriguing. Like I said, there are funny moments. But then just even when it gets down to the real nitty gritty, like I said, it's all about friends, family, and, you know, just the connection that you all have and how I'll do anything to help you. All right. Well, guys, thank you very much. Again, my time's out. I love the movie. I hope everybody goes and checks out, checks it out. Uh, I think people need to su support these small kind of movies. And, and I think that your guys is uh, just, again, the camaraderie and the chemistry what was fantastic. Uh, best of luck to all three of you, gentlemen. Thanks, thank Tom. You. Have a good day, man. Gentlemen, thank you so very, very much for your time. Like I said, really enjoyed. And uh, Shay, I'm quite sure we'll be back together again next week for something. <laughs> thank, thank you for the kind words, brother. We, we appreciate it.